Okay. Uh, last time. Last time. I had a bit of trouble. Actually, went off went off stream for a bit and did some digging because I need to do some digging. Uh, I need the drill arm, which I got now, and I'm gonna drill some stuff and rescue pod 19 or 13, one of them. 20 hours in. I'm not even close to the end. So I went and scavenged for some stuff, and now I have the drill arm, and now I have the torpedo arm, and I have a grappling arm. For the pawn. I actually went looking for some wrecks in the kelp forest near the, the alien cannon, but couldn't find any. Okay, so. Part 13, 175 meters deep. Let's take a Seamoth. Now Seamoths are armored. Maybe we should get more armor. I'm gonna listen to the radio when I get back. But it has a perimeter defense and a torpedo system. So, should be fine. Use the torpedo. The system's defense is the main one. And then we'll see. Maybe I'll buy more armor for it later. I would also like to thank Pissed Off Friendly Gamer who followed me, which is very nice. Thank you. So, apparently, we just had an earthquake. Leave me alone. Uh, apparently there an, was an earthquake in Turkey and it was felt here, except we live on the fifth floor and that somehow helps because I didn't feel a thing. Yeah, those mouthy things. And I've actually felt some earthquakes in my lifetime. Not as fun as one would hope. Okay. Yeah, we're going through the top. PDA. Oh yeah, I also picked up some PDAs and stuff that I saved for staying here. Can I disassemble this? Disassemble that. No, I can't. Is that important? That's lithium. Also lithium. Can I take you for a spin? Okay. Let's dump it in here. With the torpedoes. Apparently most storage upgrades don't do much. But I see a wreck. That is Cyclops hull fragment. That seems important. Two cells complete. Is there any other Cyclops hull fragments? Anyway, I do have some logs. Okay, what I picked up. I picked up blood oil, so I have benzene and synthetic fibers. I have Cyclops Death Modules, which I can't build yet because I need Magnetite and Nickel. I can actually go get Magnetite now. I should probably go do that. Um, I have a Prawn Suit Grappling Arm, which I built, and a Prawn Suit Drill Arm, which I built. 
I left the torpedo arm out of it. Still can't build the thermal reactor because I don't have kinite. I would really like the range upgrade, which requires magnetite. Need one more for the hull blueprint, which will probably complete the cyclops. Uh, I can build it at module one. I can build the engine efficiency module. And I can build the docking bay repair module. Cool. I scanned a bit of the nuclear reactor, which apparently I don't have all of it. And I have a power cell charger, which I already, already built. But I don't really need it because I don't really drain the batteries that much. Okay. Wait, what other blueprint I missed? The Neptune launch, yeah, Neptune gantry, Neptune boosters, or a nickel, which I don't currently own. Right, steel suit. No really need for it because I'm not playing with water. Okay, blueprints. Steel suit, uh, designed for minimized water loss, by filtering and recycling. Reclaimed water is stored in containers for later consumption. Uh, no less than four different bodily excretions, I don't want to know. Uh, on both flavor neutralizer can be activated at startup. Flavor neutralizer not included in all models. The steel suit, because drinking reclaimed urine is better than death by dehydration. I did build the reinforced dive suit, so at least I have that shock absorption. Okay, uh, power. Nuclear reactor. Renewable energy sources will usually be sufficient for maintaining small outposts. For everything else, there's a nuclear power. Powered by up to four replaceable uranium reactor rods, which I probably need to get. Do not attempt to replace reactor rods without a full radiation suit. Sure. Do not attempt to overclock the reactor. Nuclear is ideal for energy intensive operations such as self sufficient colonies supporting more than 20 people, industrial outposts operating multiple docks and heavy machinery, like me. Research stations housing live specimens, like me. I should probably build it away from my regular habitat. Okay, downloads. Life part 3, play. What? No, don't think that's how it goes. Okay, I think someone didn't love him enough. Ow. Wait. That's an egg. Hmm, I thought it was kinite. Let's try again. What is life part three? Right there. Why isn't it marked? Look, I found a whole fragment. There has to be something else. Wait, what? What? Didn't I just scan this? I can build a Cyclops! Yeah, the egg. And now, I have Cyclops Hall. I can build Cyclops. Uh, okay. I can do this. I have the materials for it. Let's see what the other logs say. 
זה לא ריסר של מנהל סקי מישן בר טורגל, פוזיציון וייס פרזנט דו טורגל קור, לוסט אין ספייס ניר פלנט 4546B, אייג' טיים אוף דיספרנס 19. The only legitimate child of Paul Torgal, beneficiary of enhanced learning techniques and cerebral implants, digitrain and advanced biochemistry and stellar economics. MSRI Kassar reports Bart was accompanying his father to a newly constructed deep space station where he was to serve a five year term as chief operating officer. Corporate profile, Torgal Corp. Torgal Corporation is a long standing family run clan that operates almost a dozen mining and trading operations. The company share prices hit an all-time high on the announcement by a Mongolian cabal of their intention to construct a new phase gate utilizing Torgal materials. These plans were put on hold when Bart Torgal, the intended leader of the new mining operation, disappeared along with his father roughly a decade ago. What life forms did I find? The cab squid. Oh, that's an annoying thing. Yeah, danger level high. This large predator can be found in deep waters. It lurks amongst the blood kelp. Membrane trees can deploy a powerful electromagnetic pulse, which shuts down my brawn. Ten limbs feature different appendages for swimming, walking, hunting, and possibly even tool use. Creatures caught in these gaps are expertly, expertly butchered and quickly consumed. Rays and other illuminated herbivores of its usual prey will approach and attack any light source. CMP blast was likely developed as a response to predation by creatures with electron, electrical hunting mechanism. Interesting. While cow squids appear to have large brains, resemblance to intelligent squids of Earth, the organ inside the creature's head is in fact its stomach, which it must fill with startling regularity. Neutralizes electrical equipment, light, uh, lights attract its unwanted attention. That's a stomach. Okay. Yeah, I found a sea trader leviathan. Danger level low. Vast bipedal leviathan which roams the reefs in herds grazing the seafloor. Antennae on the creature's head can detect a range of scents, helping the sea traders to find fresh grazing pastures, avoid the path of large predators, and sense chemical signals from others of their kind. Thick armor protects the creature from attack by all but the largest of carnivores. Two legs extend from the rear. Yeah, that's the front part. Use the siphon enough plant materials from the seafloor and maintain balance. Large herds will decimate the flora of a single area and encourage the sea traders' migratory behavior. Families keep the area towards the center of the herd, and parents will lash out at over curious interlopers in search of an easy meal. Sea trader herds may unearth mineral deposits as they churn up the sand. Interesting. Also found a time capsule by the twins. Holy hell, where is that? Faith and Ivy May. Where can I find that? Okay, I think time to go home and build a Cyclops. Doesn't it take energy when I do that? That takes energy. But I have solo charging. Why can't this thing go faster? By the way, give me access to this, give me that, I'll handle the rest. Ouch, ouch, ouch. I have a lot of base. And I went in through the wrong entrance.
It's okay. Everything's okay. Okay, take medkits, take batteries, anything needs a charge. Meh, meh. No, everything's fine. Dump this and this and all the excess batteries and the medkit. And I need to go up top side. If I'm not mistaken, the Cyclops can carry the brawn. Yeah, to build the next phase of the Neptune launch system. Where is it? I need nickel. Please, build me a Cyclops. Must be constructed in deeper water. What do you mean? How deep? Um, climb? I already climbed. Can't I pick this thing up? Or do I need to build another one? Mobile vehicle bay. Titanium lubricant power cell. Deeper water. This is all powered up. It's gaining a bit of power. Um, so, mobile vehicle bay. Hold that thought. Are you fully challenged or something? Walking on it. Uh, let's look at a bit of flora. Blood root, yeah, found that thing. Uh, it breaks through. Cave wall penetrates into the rock. And they produce blood oil. Um, yeah. Blood vine. Species of kelp in the blood kelp forest. Uh, life on the better home developed unusual coping mechanisms, bleaching of skin pigment, uh, naturally occurring metals and oils, electrical defense mechanisms, uh, semi hard postules. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Um, let's step outside. and find some deeper water. How about over here? Is this deep enough? Let's go deep. Okay. Fire it up.
Cyclops. Ah. But this is deeper water. Cannot build here. Must be constructed in deeper water. Okay, can I at least pick up my thing? Thank you. Okay, so where do I put it? This isn't deep enough. Wait, isn't there a drop off like right over there? No, I need to go here. So, to the west, into the Kelp Forest. Yeah. Actually, beyond the camp post. Okay, let's go a bit south, hit that wreck, and then we'll see. Yeah, generally that way. No, no, no. You can explode all you want on your own time. Yeah, I think I've already been here. Uh, the company, so from a TV show, The Office? No, s just save it now. That's it. Uh, I didn't actually watch The Office. Let's mark this as done. Okay, is this deep enough? Probably not. Must go deeper. What's that? Mobile vehicle bay. Oh, it's okay, I've got one. There's another wreck, which I already explored. Okay, is this deep enough? Eject me! It's not moving. Can I build a Cyclops now? I'm too far away. To use the base resources. <sighs> this is your Shishi Night Out. No, this is my Shishi Night In. <laughs> okay, plasteel ingots, enamel glass, lead, and advanced wiring kits. Yeah, I'm a grumpy old bastard and I spend my Friday night in playing games. Uh, I'm actually... I actually can't drink alcohol at the moment, thank you. And it's far too late for me to just go out right now. Go to the base over here. Okay, for the <laughs> well, thank you for the gesture anyway. <clears throat> um, Cyclops, Cyclops, three plastic plastic ingots, three enameled glass, three. Plus steel. I need the I need the wiring kit, right? I need the advanced wiring kit. Okay. Three plus steel ingots. Three enameled glass. 
lubricant and three lead. Lubricant. Take lubricant. I'm all stuffed. Take lubricant. Well, thank you for spending your Friday night here. Plastic ingots, enamel glass, lubricant, lead, advanced wiring kit. Yeah, I think I'm good. Okay, let's do this. Let's grab a seamoth. Let's grab a prawn. I grapple you? No, don't grapple that. <laughs> Follow the dog. Um, yeah, let's aim for that other wreck. Just need to set it up and build it. Almost there. You want a piece of me? Okay, there it is. Not useful, not useful. Definitely not useful. Terra vending machine. You wanna play? Let's play. Come here, let's play. just salvage that's just salvage that's a part of a bioreactor that's a CMOS bioreactor of course I'm not gonna get complicated stuff so close to base okay is this deep enough Apparently I'm faster than that thing. Okay. Please, build me one Cyclops. Oh yeah! Decoy tube? 40 foot sub for one. Well, I'm sorry. Well, if you can find some helmsmen, let me know. In the meantime, I'm going to use it as is. Back it up. Holy crap, this thing's huge! That's how you enter? Okay, let me check this thing out for a bit, on the outside, that's nice. Engine offline, hopefully. 40 foot sub. 
Okay, the pawn is down there. Let's go. Oh. Cool. That's the ladder. Close this. Eh, don't close this thing. I have storage. I have lots of storage. That's cool. Is that a vehicle bay? I think it is. <coughs> <coughs> Engine room, I, I believe. Oh, that's an engine. Definitely an engine. Upgrades. I've got nothing for you now. Cyclops decoy tube upgrade. Uh huh. Cyclops shield generator. Sonar upgrade. Energy 1200. Okay, apparently I cut out for a minute, but my recordings are on. 1500 health. Three power cells. Probably not three, probably six. Six power cells. How the hell does this thing charge? Decoy launchers. Okay, not sure what I'm doing with this. But okay. That's a vehicle. And that's the cockpit. Toggle internal lighting off. Toggle external floodlights off. On. Cute. Control console. Cyclops modification station. Base color. There's gonna be some dark green right there. Submarine name. Tempest. Stripe one. Put in some deep red. Stripe two. Maybe a deep blue. Name. Bright white. Done. Close it. Pilot the sub. Hello. Engine on? Holy crap! Rig for silent running. Uh, down? Let's get in range of the pawn. So I can dock it. Okay. I can control as well. Traffic flagged. Emergency speed. Ahead standard. Okay. Uh, power down. Powering down. Damn, it takes a lot of power. That was 4%. Maybe it was silent running. I have a horn. Hang on a minute. <laughs> okay, let's get that prawn in here. It's over there, okay. Dock me! Awesome. Super awesome. Energy charging. Pawn suit. Lovely. 
Just beautiful. Let's take this baby home. Engine up. Give me a head slow. And let's follow that Leviathan. Okay, I head quicker. I have my own sub. This is so cool. Yeah, I'm making a whole heck of a lot of noise. What the hell is that? What does that mean? Proximity alert! Proximity alert! Got it. Okay, turn the engine off. Let's see what I can build for this thing. Welcome aboard, Captain. Also, now that it's over there, how about I despawn this and despawn this I can't despawn anymore because I'm my inventory Okay, so one auto sorter here. And store that away, please. Then give me a fabricator. No, give me the small monitor. Over here. Give me a fabricator over here. I actually don't need this con this place anymore. Or can I just put the upgrade thing here? No. No, it has to be somewhere over here. So, destruct that. And put the upgrade, upgrade console over here. Seamoth docked. Hmm, no I don't like it. Put the reinforcement back on. I can't deconstruct it as long as it's reinforced.
solar panel and floodlights. things. <laughs> Beautiful sub. Okay. Blood light. Solar panel. Floodlight. Moon pool. Maybe I shouldn't really build my moon pool somewhere else. It's too shallow. No, yeah, never mind. Now, upgrade console. And store the rest of it. What can we do for the Cyclops. I can't. Um, that's not Cyclops compatible. So, is it only on the Cyclops? I think it is. Thank you. Um, turn the lights off if you're not using them. Okay, maybe turn the lights on when I am using them. Okay, so that's the internal modification station. Oh yeah. Um, that's not helpful. Already drained to sixty-three percent. Okay, upgrades. How do I build upgrades for you? Does not stack. Engine efficiency. Cyclops docking bay repair module, that's important. And tube upgrade. I don't know what that means. I want to build all of that. What are you cleared for anyway? Hang on a minute. Subnautica Cyclops. Cyclops. Cyclops, blah 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 blah, cleared for 500 meters, 900 with the first module. Uh, 54 meters long, 12 meters wide, and 14 meters tall. Largest vehicle available, can be utilized as a mobile base. Can be outfitted with furniture. Uh, blueprints, yeah. Features, blah 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 blah. At speeds. It spawns with six power cells and two extinguishers. 
Uh, they can replace it. Uh, okay. If we just look at it in the bell. Vehicle bay. Dock a seaman for a pawn. They will recharge while docked, draining the Cyclops power cells. And they will be repaired automatically with the repair module. Okay. Upgrades. Can be customized using the onboard upgrade fabricator located on the starboard side of the engine room. Aha. Uh -huh. I probably missed it. There you are. Cyclops Tech Module 1. Yes, please. Cyclops Engine Efficiency. Yes. Docking Repair Module. Tube Upgrade. I'm not sure what to do with that. But I'll take the repair bay. Cool. Still need to find other stuff. Equip, equip, equip. Crash that now 900 meters engine efficiency 300%. Excellent. Someone is still swimming through my stuff. So where is the other extinguisher? And why is this closed? Because there's a prawn here. It's big. This is where I hold my stuff. Very short term storage. Now I can put things in here. That's the other extinguisher. Um, what? happened to my repair tool. I used it to build the repair module. That was extremely smart of me. Also, I should really remember to turn the lights off when I'm done. But I need another repair tool. Repair tool. Why does it keep erroring? Cool. I can build Cyclops upgrade when I get Nickel and Kyanite. Great. And magnetite. Let's go get some magnetite. But let's listen to the radio first. What you got? This is Life Pod 2 coordinates attached. We're way past our safe depth and bleeding O2. We'll have to swim to the surface, but it's 500 meters straight up. We'll make for the rendezvous and keep you posted. Out. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Is that, is it that? Yeah. CTO use life pod sank before she abandoned it. Um, that's where it is. Okay, life pod three. Turn it off. Off. Life pod 13 is off, life pod 17 is off. Jelly Shroom Cave. I want to go back again. Turn life pod 17 on. Because that's the other end of the Mushroom Cave. The grassy plateau. Life pod 19. I guess I can go back to it. Also, want to check out this alien vent. 250. Yeah, I've got stuff to do. Okay, let's go for life pod 2. 
Actually, let's go magnetite, then life part two. Internal lights off, outside lights on. Back it up, engine on. What does that mean? External camera! Uh, conning tower! Awesome! Screw! Cool! You look forward, you look back, you look He'll look down. Okay. Nice. Back it up. I love it, I have a sub now. Go down! What the hell did I hit? That was my structural integrity report. Okay. Um, did I visit that track? Yeah, this track is cleared. I think. Actually, I don't believe it is cleared. Sorry. Turn the lights off, and we'll see how I handle it. That's yeah, fine. Cutter, salvage, big hull piece. I think I actually have been here. Hello. Oh, it's nothing. That's something. Seamoth. Oh, I hate you guys so much. But I think I'm good. I'll go take my huge sun now. Outside light, please. And let's go. Yeah, this is clear, this is cleared. Okay. Wait, if I can build stuff on it... Can I build a power cell charger? 
Yes, I can. Can I have one like here? Ruby Titanium and Advanced Wiring Kit. Next time I'm home. Internal lights off, sub on. Sub down. Why are you glitching? Nah. Sunk 500 meters in the Blood Kelp Forest. The Blood Kelp Forest is problematic. Because of all the floating islands. How about I uh, look at the cameras? And just do this. No, back a bit, back. Oh, I'm looking at the back, okay. Okay, I think that's good. Extreme collision detection. Gotcha. Lights off. What the hell is that? That's a brain crab. I'm gonna hurt you. Okay, stop bugging me. New radio message, excellent. What's this? Cycle of Step Module 1. But I already have it. There we go. Why isn't the hatch walking? He's twitching to the surface. Okay. Right, PDA data. data. PDA data. Chief Technical Officer. Flotation devices failed. We're flooding. Evacuate. I can reconfigure the O2 system to act as a bilge pump. Working. Okay, good news. We're alive and we've stopped sinking. Bad. E oxygen's going to run out in 30 minutes and we're <laughs> 500 meters down. What do we do? 
We'll have to use the remaining juice to send a distress call and build whatever gear we can. Then we find a way to the surface. Cool. Um, I forgot I wanted to motorize some kelp. So, um, some magnetite. So let's head to life pod 17 now. Up, 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 up. That's a repel. Let's punch it, shall we? We're fine. Why? Fine. Fine, a head standard. Are you recharging with solar energy? We. Can I repair you with a repair tool? Hell is that? Live back. Cyclops is so cool. It's fine, don't worry about it. And that was the entrance. Oh my god, seriously? Okay, how do I repair this thing? There's a biters. Biters are stuck to my hull. Okay, any other damages? I don't see any other damage.
Get the hell off my hull. Why are systems offline? Also, turn off the engine. Yeah, don't use unnecessary power. No, I need to go up the ladder. And go into my pawn. Down we go. My shot, my sub isn't showing. Okay. Okay, I didn't c properly map all of this. So let's see what we can do about that. Forget grappling hook. Am I stuck? Okay, it's not, this place is not that big. Drill lithium. Give me all the lithium. Sweet. Don't mess with me. I'm tougher than you. Not sure what that is. Drill for magnetite. Finally. Uh, 
And I've been online for an hour and 14 minutes. And it's 11 and a half at night. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to keep drilling until I get all the magnetite I, I want. Then go back to base and finish building my power solar chargers. So, see you back at base. Thank you for watching. See you next time.